Hi, Sharon Danley here with another two-minute vocal tip. 45% of the impressions you make are related to your voice, a primary communication tool. A pleasant voice tone and well-rounded vocabulary communicates excellence and it does build rapport. Picture it, as Sophia used to say. A person impeccably groomed and attired with a body language and posture that exudes confidence, intelligence, and warmth. They speak, but you can hardly hear them. Or they twain a phrase like nut never hoid. Maybe you're blown back by bravado. Or probably they just drop the ends of their words so you can't understand a thing you're saying, eh? This can be just as difficult to read as it is for someone to understand the speaker that doesn't articulate or command their voice. Your vocal image always makes an impact, one way or the other, especially in that all-important job interview or even impressing a new date. And on the phone or voicemail, your vocal impression becomes a whopping 83% of your communication. The words you choose and how they are articulated communicates an impression of your intelligence, background, and skill level, whether it's true or not. Your voice tone has the most impact. If you deliver in a monotone, the impression received is boredom. Or if you speak slowly and expressionless, you are perceived to be depressed. If your pitch is high and fast-paced, your listeners would think you are, well, like, excited or, like, on something or very young. On the other hand, if you are abrupt and loud, uh, you may feel or make people feel that you are aggressive. Correct enunciation, however, will allow for appropriate pacing and give your listeners the experience of lyrical or musical sounds. And that, my friends, is compelling.